Today we are making delicious cranberry thumbprint cookies. So everybody loves cranberries during the holidays, but I always find there's a little bit left in the dish when dinner is over. Do not throw that out. So to start, we are going to just mix our wet ingredients, including half a cup of drippy tahini, and then just a third a cup of maple syrup, and lastly, just a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Whisk that together until fully combined. Now for the dry ingredients, it is one cup of white or oat flour and then half a teaspoon of baking powder. Whisk that together. Now we're just gonna combine the wet and the dry to make your cookie dough. You wanna mix it until it resembles something like this. You're gonna take that cookie dough and just set it on to your baking sheet. Now just take a spatula or a measuring cup and flatten these into a cookie shape. So now for the fun part, you're gonna take those leftover cranberries and make your thumbprint. Now that you've got your thumbprint made, just scoop out half a tablespoon of cranberry sauce per cookie. Now just pop those in the oven for about 12 minutes. The last few spoonfuls of that cranberry sauce turned into these incredible tahini cranberry cookies. Thank you so much for having me, Rachel. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Carly, those are beautiful recipes and I love the flavor of tahini, so I think I would make cranberry sauce all winter long just to get to the cookie part of the leftovers. <laughs> Uh, the debut cookbook is Plant You, and it's, of course, available now.